Hey guys, it's Sarah. So I figured it's about time to give you guys a room tour in my sorority house. So it is a bit of a mess right now because we're in the process of leaving for Thanksgiving break. So I'll like I'll I'll just show you like what's normally there, what's not. But we are switching rooms when for second semester so this is the first room i've had at this house for those of you who are new i am in alpha gamma delta at indiana university and yeah so i'll just start so this is what it looks like whoa the lighting this room is meant for eight girls but we only have six currently living in this room um, and it is a day room so it has our desks and all of our clothes and stuff like that and then we have cold dorms which is essentially just like a room with a bunch of bunk beds for us to sleep in which sounds kind of scary but I promise it's really not as bad as it seems it can be a little annoying sometimes but that's gonna happen either way when you're living with a bunch of girls so Okay, so this is what it looks like when you first walk in. Um, we have a little fridge. It's kind of messy over here because we are like getting rid of the stuff inside our fridge for the break because we'll be gone. Um, but behind that are our paddles that we got. So this is Soph's, this is mine, this is Upsara's, and this is Audra's. So I'm not gonna go like too in depth of my roommate's desk but this is just what it looks like um and then we have this one desk in the middle just to like put stuff on um or eat at i don't know it doesn't really matter and then a trash can and then this is one half of our closet space so it's just like hanging space you could put bins up here and then these dressers come with and that's all nice and then since we do have the eight girl room it opens up we have some posters up here which is pretty nice i'll show you audra's desk it's really cute okay cool sorry audra we have another trash can there don't know what's on the floor um a mirror right here it was here when we moved in but the rooms don't come with a mirror it was just there so that was kind of nice we didn't have to set up a mirror so then we have this calendar that we don't really use like ever i just sometimes write on it when it's a new month <laughs> um but that's about it and then we have two of those little storage drawers things see if you can't tell these are two stacked on top of each other to make four drawers but it's like two separate ones so we made a little ottoman thingy and then it's overexposed but then we put a little fuzzy blanket on top so sometimes you can sit on it and it's nice to have like the extra storage underneath for like cleaning supplies and stuff so suitcase that's not normally there all right okay so i'm trying to make this not super overexposed but we have this futon it can go up or down it's a queen size bed and we just have a bunch of blankets on it and pillows and it's super comfy and then there's some drawers underneath for storage and we just put like snacks and stuff in there and then i brought this from home just to like pack stuff in and i was gonna throw it out if we didn't use it because it's really old so we just like throw extra blankets in there and stuff as well um and then this is my area it kind of like looks messier than it is just because everything's like so clumped together but i have this thing at the bottom which i put sweatshirts in i'll show you one in a second but i also put like extra sheets and stuff in there but then i'll show you my drawers i also have like boots and stuff that won't fit in this shoe rack um on the bottom this is my laundry bag it's from target i love it laundry backpack but anyway so in this bottom drawer it is all like exercise workout clothes like leggings sports bras tank tops stuff like that and then in this one is my pajamas half of my stuff is like dirty right now but whatever and then this one is t-shirts and long sleeves um yeah and then this top one is just bras and underwear and socks and bathing suits <laughs> kind of random it's kind of annoying to close this because my like shirts and pants get stuck because they're long 
but that's basically what's hanging like skirts jeans dresses jackets stuff like that i have this bin here that i keep like hats and stuff in and i also put my pajamas in there during the daytime because i'm not the type of person that changes my pajamas every day but some people are but that's just too much laundry for me so and then i also have this little bin right here it kind of got messy usually it's folded nicely but these are just like tank tops going out shirts small shirts that don't really need like a full drawer for and then i also have these bins up here so oh, this first one i'm not gonna bring that down this first one is hair tools this one is like extra like tide pods laundry stuff tampons stuff like that and then this one is like self tanner nail polish all that kind of stuff and then this one that says agd don't know why there's a mask right by it but that's my cowboy hat from barn dance and then it also is tailgate stuff also um i highly recommend getting cowboy boots and a cowboy hat because if you're in greek life there's a lot of things that you'll wear it to um we have barn dances as state parties there's like country themed parties and then also for formal a bunch of brats take sororities to nashville so there are a ton of opportunities for that so i have cheap ones but honestly if you wanted to invest in nicer ones then you'd get use out of it so okay then i also have this hanging shoe rack i had to get a new one because my first one broke since i stuffed so much stuff in it um but the top one i just have sweatpants the next one i have sweaters then I have nice pants, and then the rest of it is shoes. So, yep. This is an overview of our side of the closet area. Also, these are my drawers. They just have sweatshirts in them. That's what I was going to say. Um, if I don't feel like climbing back here to put sweatshirts away, I just put them on that thing. So, that's pretty nice. It's a lot of space, but not every room has this much space. So, yeah. Okay, moving along to my desk. Mine is kind of like squished against the futon, so that's sort of annoying. Um, but this is what it looks like. So I just have pictures up here. I need to like <laughs> tape this sign. Claire made it for me for my birthday, but it falls down, so I have to hang it up. But I just have these pictures, posters. The circle thing is from Five and Below, and this lightning bolt is from Amazon. And then, um, this, people have these big desk hutches, but I didn't want to bring that with me because I kind of have a long drive in a small car. So I got this smaller one from Amazon and I honestly really like it. This is just my makeup mirror. I have some jewelry on that that I wear quite often. This is face self tanner because I forgot to put it away. And then lotion that I use every day. This plant that my aunt gave me. If you saw my dorm tour, you probably saw that. My crystals, um, this is my badge for badge chapters. Um, this is my clock. It is still an hour fast because I didn't reset it for daylight savings, but whatever. I really like this clock. It's also from Amazon. Then this is my little jewelry box situation thing from Amazon. Measuring tape. That's really nice to have for dimensions and stuff. This is kind of random stuff. Some masks, coins, deodorant, whatever. And then down here I have lotion essential oils all that fun stuff and then here i have this little like spinning rack for my makeup and skincare which is really nice um i really like this and it kind of like puts it all in a little corner so it's not in a mess everywhere oh i should put this in here but yeah and then <laughs> this flower is so sad i should probably throw it out but um we got some roses from when a frat we pair with serenaded us um that's a thing but yeah that flower's dead and then i just have like random stuff my lamp i really recommend getting a lamp with like storage cubbies for pens and stuff um and then just q-tips tissues my fan and then back here i have my towels hanging because there wasn't really a space for it um and then these drawers are kind of a mess 
so I'll just like show you one for an example but it just has my like medicines and my makeup and pens and whatever um and then also all the rooms come with this my camera just turned off I don't know why oh shit if that wasn't recording I'm gonna be so mad but every room comes with this on the desk and it just has like outlets and stuff for charging um and then under my desk I have garbage and then I also have this little container that I put like workbooks in that I don't use all the time and I also made these so pretty fun all right you guys so I hope that was interesting um and gave you some advice if you are planning on joining a sorority i know that a bunch of you had recruitment in the fall or you are just thinking about it for the springtime um either way i really liked watching these types of videos when i was joining greek life at first also um these like plaques canvases you can see one like right over there and then there's two above me and like one over there all over the room for decoration um you usually get a bunch of that and clothes from your big when you first get into a sorority um so that's really nice for decorations also like i said with these letters over here like i made them so it's super fun to just like make your own decorations in addition to like getting some um but yeah i think we tried utilizing the space as best as we could um it's kind of weird because like people are leaving for thanksgiving and then also i'll do another one of these when i switch rooms so i hope you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you aren't already i love you bye